we've heard on the news that they have been charged with misdemeanors and um it's just really disheartening a deadly trend with innocent victims carjackings are turning into car crashes one of the most recent incidents left a six-month-old baby dead nate rogers is live with more nate yeah, that's right. I'm Corey and Don. The victims in this crash, in fact, were a mother and her three children. One of the children um, was um, one of the one of the children was um, an infant, less than six months old. We're told who died as a result. We spoke to an aunt today who described the family's pain as unbearable. Six months old, and now a cherished memory. But he was like six months, going on 26. He was just like the sweetest little boy. We would always dance. Um, he loves to dance. Sunday around 5 p.m., the family inside the silver pickup truck, then struck by the stolen Hyundai Sonata, according to police. The truck then head on into this large tree at Costner in Washington. Truly the biggest nightmare. The car seat still visible in the wreckage. Neighbors rushing to the scene to render aid. Christian Uvidia, his mother, and two older sisters all rushed to the hospital in serious to critical condition. I think a lot of but two, they've kind of blocked out just from the trauma. The six-month-old fought to stay alive for three days. He suffered from uh, a fractured skull, which um, caused his brain to swell and bleed eventually, um, causing him to go into a coma and then later passing away. The offending vehicle crashed into a light pole, police later arresting a 14 and 17 year old, both charged with misdemeanors, criminal trespass to a vehicle. The family now in deep pain, working to make funeral arrangements for a kid whose smile and infectious laugh will forever be missed. Your however minutes long joyride ruined our life completely. Now, Christian's mother had suffered a fractured pelvis and internal bleeding. She was released from the hospital today. One of his sisters, um, 15 years old, suffered a concussion and also some bleeding on her brain. Um, another sister, seven years old, suffered some bruises. As a result, one of the sisters still remains in the hospital. Um, we've yet to learn if charges will be upgraded in this case. Also, if the suspects are still in police custody. Reporting live downtown, I'm Nate Rogers, Fox 32, Chicago.